Well, Becky, this is a 9,000 square foot beachfront Malibu home. If it wasn't so dark out, you could see the waves crashing just beyond these glass walls. It's architecturally unlike any other, and the seller is unlike most because he is willing to accept Bitcoin from the buyer. For this type of the house and this type of amount, I think will attract more international buyer than our country. I'm not saying it's safe. I just want to take a risk for investment, just like everybody else. Now, of course, there are not a ton of $45 million buyers, but the boom in cryptocurrency wealth created new ones, especially international buyers. They don't want to be taxed on their gains, so buying with so far unregulated cryptocurrencies helps most fly under the radar. For luxury sellers, that then opens the pool of potential buyers. That's our job in marketing property, especially luxury real estate, is never assume where the buyer is gonna come from. Make sure we get this property out there and say, we are open to all currencies and crypto being one of them. Now, Dr. Chen says he doesn't want all of the payment in cryptocurrency, just some of it. He won't say what percentage. Obviously, hedging his bets, given how volatile it is. We saw what happened this morning. This house was about 3,200 Bitcoin yesterday. Could be different tomorrow. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.